Hi guys, I'm Suzanne from Backyard University, here to talk to you about how to repel dogs from your yard. There are few that would argue dogs are amazing and their purpose varied. They protect, love unconditionally, and they even help heal the sick. It's even been reported that they can detect health problems like cancer and COVID by using their powerful sniffers. But if they belong to your neighbor or someone down the street, do we really want them in our yards? While most dog owners are good dog owners and keep their pets on a leash equipped with a doggy bag, others aren't so considerate. Instead, they scope out yards to let their dogs do their business and leave it for you to take care of. They let their dogs run free, leaving waste and fleas in your yard and causing havoc with your own animals. So if you're looking for a way to keep dogs off your property and back in their own yards, here are a few ideas we believe at Backyard University will help. First, dogs do their business to let others know where they are so if they decide your yard is their toilet, allowing them to continue will only bring more animals. So you need to make it as unattractive as possible by using their super sniffers to your advantage. Thankfully, there are several scents dogs don't like. By spraying them where they come to visit will help you move them along to someone else's yard. First up is vinegar. Dogs hate the smell of vinegar, so make up a homemade batch and spray it around the perimeter. You can use either apple cider or regular white vinegar. Mix half the vinegar and half the water in a spray bottle and spray the perimeter. A word of caution, while it will repel the dogs, it will also kill plants. So don't use the spray on anything you want to grow. Dogs also hate the smell of hot peppers. You can use hot pepper sauce, cayenne pepper, or even pepper flakes, and it won't hurt the plants. To mix up a homemade batch, fill a spray bottle with water and place a few tablespoons of ground cayenne. Cayenne is hydrophobic so it won't dissolve like sugar or salt. Instead, it will drop to the bottom, so steep it overnight, or you can substitute the ground cayenne with a few drops of hot sauce. You can also use cayenne by sprinkling it directly in your yard. Peppermint oil is another scent that will repel dogs. You can fill a spray bottle with water and add 10 to 20 drops of peppermint essential oil and spray around the area. There are also many commercial sprays, such as Mighty Mint, that contain peppermint oil. Using vinegar, cayenne, and peppermint oil will not only repel dogs, but other insects such as fleas, ants, and spiders. Here's a quick tip. When using homemade sprays, make sure you reapply after it rains. When using the dog's scent to repel it from your yard, you can also use plant repelling plants including peppermint, lemongrass, marigolds, lavender, and rosemary. If you are looking for other ways to keep your dog off your property, you may wish to invest in an ultrasonic motion detector. This one by A. Billy's infrared sensor detects motions and triggers an ultrasonic tone undetected by humans, but it will scare away the animals. There are also motion detecting sprinklers like this one from How the Heart that will automatically spray the dog when it comes into your yard. Getting rid of unwanted dogs goes a lot further than just cleaning up after them. Animals bring fleas and ticks into your yard, and the poop they leave can attract rodents like rats, starting an unwanted cycle. 
By doing one or a combination of these remedies, we at Backyard University believe you will soon be on your way to a healthy, dog-free backyard. If you have any other backyard concerns or questions, click the link below to check out our other videos or visit our website at backyarduniversity.org. We've also supplied links to our mentioned products for your convenience.